of time. Uh, shoot, always prepared. It's about 15 minutes till nine, or quarter to nine uh, for the mathematician. Um, so far, pretty good. I had uh, little tiny ups and downs. I wouldn't really call them hills, not compared to the other day. Holy cow, that, that really, that really, made me sick uh oh I, I didn't feel good at all last night it might have been from the sun it might have been just exerting myself way too much because that was that was hard that was really hard but feeling really good this morning um like i said not very many hills and uh cooking right along already gone about 35 kilometers and uh there's uh, some hotels about uh another 30 up the way but I'm feeling really good I think I could probably do another 80 or you know 80 all together but uh, yeah so we'll see how the rest of the day progresses um, we're about the turning point for when it really starts getting warm so we'll see calling it an early day today just because uh, I uh, did 60, 60 kilometers, but um, it was like another 60 before I hit, a, hit another hotel. And I'm kind of glad I did because it's uh, raining pretty heavy. You gotta love this, no blanket. Just like mom used to make it. You be good when in the morning you get bread and water for breakfast. Look at this, I'm loving this. Just nature, the open road, and trash. <laughs> Keep her steady. I really wish there were more of a shoulder though. But, uh, man, just a minute ago went over a two lane road or two lane bridge. Anywhere else it would have been considered a one lane bridge. And uh, just traffic like that. Just non-stop trucks and cars and my chain falls off. Son of a gun. Okay, this is like the third or fourth time I've had to rearrange my gear. I took out the, the, the tent poles and I have one of those thermal rest seats. Um, you just put it with your uh, thermal rest mattress and makes the chair. Um, and, uh, won't be using it for Southeast Asia. Probably won't be using it until I get to Europe. But uh, so with everything in there, it just stuck out way too far. And this bike, it, it uh, develops quite a uh, shimmy as this rear stuff is moving the handlebars develop like a death rattle death, death shake um, so you just gotta what I do is I put like my heaviest stuff in the front panniers and then some of the heavy stuff is just too big like the thermos mattress and stuff like that so uh, I, I obviously can't put them up in the front but uh, yeah, yeah, so how am I liking the frame so far? It's a lot lighter than the commotion. So I'm actually able to go faster with it, which is awesome. Uh, I, I'm still getting used to it. It reminds me a lot, a lot of my uh, Surly. Holy shit, bent the hell out of that. What did I hit? When did that happen? pretty hard on my stuff um, what was I gonna say yeah so the riding is uh, almost identical to the uh, Navara Safari uh, there is a little bit more flex and stuff because this is a the Navara was a uh, steel or aluminum frame and this is a steel frame so I think I figure out what the heck I did there gotta call Metlock this is a tripod that I utterly hate. 
Um, it works good if you have a light camera, but uh, my camera is a little too heavy. I need, just need to get a bigger version of this, but it just flexes around and crap and falls over. Okay, action shots. Hooray. Some of these roads are bumpy as hell, and there's a big ass truck right behind me. Oh shit. Kill myself. I want the girl over there. Yeah. This is actually a, a good section of road. It gets a lot worse than this. Okay. Let me find a place to pull over here. <gasps> It's like perfect weather right now. It's overcast. Uh, there's a breeze. Okay. Enough of this. Back in your coffin you go, you son of a bitch. Probably some of the worst roads I've ever ridden on, but watch these guys. Let's not even take it slow. Well, yeah, so far they're doing pretty good. Let's see what this guy does. Yeah, he did pretty good too. I saw a van. Doggone, I thought he was gonna tip that sucker. Come on, man. As soon as I sh show on him. They proved me wrong. Oh, here's a speed demon. Oh yeah. Hit it. Hit it. Wuss. Don't have Doritos, but have Happy Toes. The world's dumbest drivers right here. Jesus. It's a two lane road. They can barely make it up it. They want to pass. And there's huge trucks coming on the other side. Yep. Motorcyclists on... It, just, just dumb, dumb, stupid dumb. Well, a lot more uh, Hindu shrines. I didn't see... When I was in Java, I didn't see any Hindu shrines or temples. Whichever you want to call them. southern tip of Sumatra there's the big picture I gotta make it up to up there which is where Demai is that's where the port this is the blue line here that's tomorrow's route 